He understands that piece about being a servant, right? We need a workhorse. We don't need a show horse. Now, why issue trustees chair Mike Peterson was talking there about Congressman Bill Johnson, the trustees candidate of choice to become the next university president. Good evening, I'm Dave Sess. Lindsey Watson's off. It's not a done deal. Each side admits they still have to negotiate a contract, and Congressman Johnson says he has to decide if he wants the job. First News reporter Nadine Grimley has more. I move that Congress, Congressman Bill Johnson be offered the position of president of Youngstown State University. In an 8-1 to one vote during an emergency meeting Thursday afternoon, Youngstown State University's Board of Trustees moved to offer the job of university president to Republican Congressman Bill Johnson. We wanted someone who loved Youngstown State. We wanted someone who was passionate about this university, who'd be passionate about the students. And that's what we have. Only board member Molly Seals objected to the decision to extend the offer to Congressman Johnson. I do not believe the congressman is right for this job. The university had been searching to fill the position left vacant when former President Jim Trestle retired. Johnson was one of three finalists for the job. Peterson says the other two had backgrounds in education. In a statement, Johnson says his focus remains on representing his constituents in the U.S. House of Representatives. He added he'll have a difficult decision to make should he decide the offer is a good fit. While some are excited about the possibility of Johnson becoming president... And I really believe that he'll do great things for us. Others, not so much. YICU faculty union spokesman Mark Vopat issued a statement saying, in part, we are surprised and disappointed that the board would offer the presidency to anyone without first having a campus visit to meet with university stakeholders, especially someone with no higher education experience or a terminal degree in any academic field. In Youngstown, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.